Hello, what's up guys, I'm living here, coming at you with a duel. Right now I'm going to be testing out another budget deck for you guys, uh, Battling Boxers. Uh, Battling Boxers are a pretty awesome deck, pretty competitive deck as well. Um, I do own the deck in real life, uh, so I might do the deck profile in real life, I don't know, depends on how I feel to be honest. <laughs> I'm kidding, not how I feel, I'm not a deck like that. Uh, but let's go and do this shit shit. Let's normal almost on the headgear. Effect. I'm, I'm, very, I'm sorry, I'm kind of hyper. Uh, today was, uh, I live in Florida, guys, in the United States. Uh, I don't know where, like, my demographic is mostly from. For the people that, I know, like, some people don't, like, look at me outside of state. Outside of, uh, I know that some people look at me outside of the United States. So, but here in Florida, um, we finally entered school. It was, like, the shortest summer vacation in the world, to be honest. But we entered school finally, and, I mean, not really much I can say about it. I'm very tired like very tired um i don't know how i'm doing a video right now <laughs> but uh whatever right so unfortunately i opened up pretty okay i guess i mean i don't have a single trap in my hand and i, I run 11 traps i believe um what i like about battling boxes is that they're a very very good deck like super good um like way good to be honest but the what their biggest like drawback is yep you guessed it compulse because i mean not really that much stuff destroys i mean th this was going to be my main deck for the last format but i don't know i guess compulse is what scared me and felt like you couldn't play the deck without three uh three for i'm sorry two i'm a, two safe zones i'm sorry um and that's a lie you can uh but I mean, it depends on how you play. I mean, most decks are running two to three compulses. Like, even me, look, I'm running one, two, three compulses in the deck just because of Dragon Rulers. Even though I know Dragon Rulers are not going to be a big deal. Um, still, I'm just kind of scared, <laughs> to be honest. So, yeah, first turn, most people were like, why would you send the headgear? Well, because I had another headgear in my hand. So, headgear's a fact. I could have sent glass draw, glass draw, get headgear, switch hitter. I'm sorry, switch hitter back to hand. So now I have two switch hitters and my glass jaw to make them live, like a boss. So, let's go for the attack. Let's attack with the yoke. Attack. Okay, let's see what this is. A go, 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 go one, huh? Okay. So I'm assuming he has like a... I'm assuming we're playing like go, go uh, zombies. Those are another very, very good deck actually. I really like the real zombies. Um, pretty, pretty cool. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure he has, like, a heavy or something like that, because he didn't say anything. Oh, I'm Zuki, never mind. Yep, so I am correct. We're playing the real zombies. So he's probably going to go into a Laval chain, uh, detach the Mizuki, and then send the ghost to the grave. I mean, why not? It's, like, the best. It's the best. Or he could detach the bell alone and then send the... Yeah, I don't know. Fuck it. I don't know, dude. Hopefully he does not have that book of life though. I think I should save the book the judgment for the book of life maybe. Cause if I don't want him to banish my glass jaw, that's the thing. Um Oh Utopia. Uh, okay. So I'm gonna be taking fifteen hundred. That's fine. I I figured he was gonna go for the Laval chain. And then just kind of do his shenanigans from there, but I guess not. Uh, I still am running a Flamebell Fire Dog because it's my personal tech. I really like that card. Okay. Should we YOLO it, guys? <laughs> um. Yeah, let's YOLO it. Yeah, let's YOLO it. Overlay this. I was thinking going into a dire wolf, and the, but then I'll lose field presence, and I'd rather have field presence. So I'm just gonna go for the maestro here and uh, detach the switch hitter. I'm just, uh, I always say switch hitter, uh, the headgear, and then just attack over Utopia. And then I'm in a pretty good position, even though he does have the Mizuki in the grave. Probably what he wanted, but still, I got the judgment. I got the judgment. Don't have to worry about the. Next turn, I could just go switch hitter into the glass draw, 
and then um, start my looping from there. Uh, this guy never seems to get destroyed. Like, they like never seem to destroy him. Always compulse, and I kind of hate that, but whatever. I, I'm i not running any cards. At, well, I am running one card. One card. I'm not, I took out the XYZ uh, block. Even though it is a good card, I figured it would be more dead than anything else, even though it was never dead to me. Because literally, you make lead yoke like first turn. All the time, first turn. If you don't make lead yoke by turn one or two, then you're going to have a bad time in that match. Uh, or duel. But, um... Yeah, I mean, it's an amazing card, don't get me wrong, I'm actually thinking about taking it out at 1, because, I mean, it's a freaking War Chariot, um, and beefs up Lead Yoke, I mean, how awesome can that get, you know? Okay, so, image. there you go, there's a Pulse, let's go Switch Hitter now, effect, so we're dominating this duel, either, I think our opponent in the blue here did not open up so great, but whatever, I mean, you win some, you lose some, bro. Gonna special summon the lead yoke. And I'm thinking about profiling. I'm gonna profile my heraldic deck, if you guys are asking, next. Uh, tomorrow, basically. Because I was gonna profile it today. But then I was like, I'm gonna wait till the TCG ban list gets announced. The actual TCG ban list. No rumors, no OCG ban list. Because if duality goes up to three, then I'm gonna wanna add that and um, everything else. I mean, it, it's just gonna be a. a a lot slower format and it's, it's a good thing it's not a bad thing at all i really like that so here we basically got the game he can't do absolutely anything <laughs> he's basically screwed almost i feel bad for the kid but he's screwed with the judgment and compulsa and there's the card trooper uh how about a no on that yeah on summon not the effect yeah, I basically got the game. You can't do absolutely anything. And the judgment set, Book of Life. No. Yeah, I don't know how much I take here. Maybe 250? Okay. There you go. And watch, he's gonna have another Book of Life, and I'm gonna be like, oh, you just got trolled. Dark Hole? Sure, man. Uh, I still get my beaters here and then switch it in. so they're both at 3k and this motherfucker is still at 1800 so it's not bad monster reborn okay what are we gonna get yeah I don't think I have a oh, fire oh fire oh, okay so what was the point of that Oh, enemy controller, okay. Sure, dude. Here you go. Okay, so he's just gonna bump heads. Effect. Jaw effect. I forgot Jaw's effect activates, so I'm gonna go and get the switch hitter. I don't know if, I don't know if that was in my grade before, ah, whatever, I had another switch at hand, even though if, I wasn't paying attention to be honest. Yeah, I won. Game! Yep, it's a uh, basically game. Um, anyways guys, hopefully you guys enjoy, and hopefully you guys had another, like, uh, a great school day, and this has been Oblivion guys, catch you guys later, deuces.